Yay, yeah, we did it, we did it, we got a thousand subscribers. We have to say thank you to everybody. Yay! Here's the new table, guys. Yay, we got the table, finally. So, I'm actually taking care of Tyler today. I haven't had time to come to the office to shoot. But I'm gonna put this video in the unboxing video, but I just want to say thank you guys. We got a thousand subscribers, we did it, and we're just gonna keep on growing. So that was my little celebration thing, throwing the styrofoam on Tyler, like that. Look, Tyler. Yay. We did it, 1,000 subs. Yes, yes. Now don't fall off the table, please. Yay, so thank you once again, you guys. And we're just gonna keep on growing. We're gonna make this a lot more fun. I'm gonna put a lot more content out there for you. It's gonna be non-stop for the next, I don't know how long. Maybe I'll do some live stream. Maybe I'll do some more guest appearance. I don't know. We're gonna have a lot more fun. But for now, I'm gonna go back to reviewing this for the weekend and I'll catch you guys later. So enjoy the unboxing. And thank you so much again. Tyler, you wanna say break me out? Say break me out. Welcome back to Pick Me Up, Scotty, and I'm Scotty, and today it's another unboxing video. Store updates, fun little tidbit stuff here and there. I don't know, let's just have some fun and wing it, right? First of all, thank you so much for everyone subscribing and commenting. The channel is growing, and it's, we're getting really close to 1,000 subscribers, and we're getting really close to the 4,000 hours to meet YouTube's requirement, which is really awesome. Like, you guys are really watching the stuff, and that's really cool, and that only means I'm gonna give you more. We're gonna keep on growing as much as we can and I hope I can just keep on doing this for you guys. Shop updates, we're still working on shipping and you know, a lot of people have been emailing, thank you. It really does help us because we're still fine tuning things and we can get around little things and once we know how to do it, but a lot of you are going in there and emailing and thank you so much for all your kind messages. You guys are awesome and we are slowly putting up even more stuff for you guys. So more content is coming, more stuff is coming, more products are coming your way. So for today, we have the slow motion camera running again for all the slow-mo stuff, check that out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it requires a lot of lights. A lot of lights means a lot of heat and I'm sweating. I'm sweating already. I have another brand that I have heard of, but I haven't seen too much of it and it's specifically for one kind of set. So we're gonna pull it out right now. Do we have any sports fans here? Because I have yet to see any kind of stadium or, you know, basketball courts or, why don't they have those to buy available? I did find one and it's from this brand. Boom, yes, sports, soccer, World Cup is coming. But here, look, check this out. I've never seen this before, and it's from Ossini. Ossini, where did they come up with these names? I don't know. I know Ossini is really well known for the trains. I might get into those later. Oh, it's one of those boxes that I have to actually puncture here. Let's see if I can puncture it. Oh, that hurt. Ouch. No, that didn't work. Okay, I'm gonna rip there. Got those two out. And it's still taped. Okay, gotta use the knife. Oh, look at that, it has an Ossini sticker right there. Boom, 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 boom. Ooh, it's still in another box, like, two boxes we gotta open up. Here we go. Oh, that's interesting. I've just seen something I've never seen before. Material. Oh, you cheat? You want bricks? I thought it was gonna be like a real base plate. It's okay, wave it like a flag. Ole, 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 ole. Here we go. Very super small, fine manual. Screen cap that, print it, build it. You got it. Okay, we got some pieces here. Oh, we do have like some green for the field. Yeah, yeah. I don't have fun with this in the slow motion bit, so. We got a couple bags, they're not labeled. A couple bricks, they look, the bricks actually look okay. They look fine, like, not bad. More parts here. Got even more parts here. And these I think are for, yeah, these are for the minifigures to play soccer. Oh, now this is funny, this is really interesting. So here's the minifigures. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten. Okay, now, they actually sent me another bag of minifigures. Like, it's totally separate from the box. Maybe they just forgot to put it in the box. They're all the soccer balls are right there. Now, what's cool about this is, if I pull the box back out, this is real-time multiplayer. Real people, no telephones, no iPads, no video games, no Switch. Two people can play the game, and you just kind of like, play the ball there, kick the ball there yourself. Yeah, this is Austini's soccer sport. Cool. So let's see that in slow motion. See the bags? We're gonna spin this on the spinner and just have some fun with it. 
A mini figure bag. Faster. Spin. Yeah. That's what I want to see. Yeah, look at all those soccer balls go. Oh look, they have nets in here. I didn't even notice the nets. It looks like fruit. Like those things they put apples in. There we go, listen for this. Sure you can. I have to bring a friend in here to play this game with me. See who I can find. I'll play some black, some black in there and white. Oh! Next bag looks like the stand for like the the players to play on, you know, like, to really make it like a co-op game. Yeah! Faster! Faster, now it's going super fast. Yeah, look at that! Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Woo, they got the stickers here. Here we go. Asini Sports Soccer. Stay tuned for the review. We're still getting a lot of products coming in, but we do need time to backlog everything and put them into the inventory and all that kind of stuff. But we are selling LOZ. Some people have been asking about laws. We can get them for you guys. And you know, they, they make little mini cities. This is from them. But you know what? These are so small to review. This thing fell off. Where'd this come from? Okay, so we do sell these in the store. These are really micro. The whole, the whole set is like behind me somewhere. I gotta find them all, but this is the whole, whole street. And this is great if you don't have space. Again, small, small, tiny stuff. We do have it. Laws, there you go, laws. The KFC. Now to get really close to these, I need a better lens because right now I'm using like crazy ass, really nice lenses, but I don't have one that can get really, really close. So you know what? There's a brand called Zeiss. They're really good from Germany. What's up? All my fans in Germany. I love Germany, by the way. But Zeiss actually makes really dope lenses. And you know what? Let's hit them up. I'm gonna hit them up right now on my phone. I'm gonna message the guy and see if they can send me some lenses to, to show off these guys even better. Yeah, and I already got a reply. It says, good to hear that you have a new career in shooting Lego. Well, I hope this becomes a career. You never know, right? You can contact Mr. So-and-so. I won't use the real name for some Zeiss E-mount lenses. I just told him your story. So thank you guys so much. We're gonna get some Zeiss lenses so we can get some macro shots of these. And if you're a camera guy or if you're a photography guy, I'll see what lenses we can get and what we can use and change things up a little bit. I think this one is actually symbol block. It's a little bit, it's bigger. It's using like the real size block, but you know, there's tons of these mini CD stuff. I promise you I'm gonna review that for you guys. Now what's really cool is Oxford just sent me two pieces of a very, limited, it's not new, it's kind of old, it's, a v, it's like for VV, VIP people, but we were able to sell it on our store. I haven't put it up yet. I don't know what we're gonna throw it in. It's real limited. I don't know if everyone will really want one of these or not. But I can show it to you, why not? We're here, right? I won't unbox it because I don't wanna tear this open unless we have to sell it. We only have two pieces of these in the office. Look at that. This is an actual remote battle bot brick build. Looks pretty cool. You, got, you can switch them out. Look, it's got like the grinder here and it's got the thing that can like, the calls that can move up and down. It can only be used with a Samsung Android phone or any Android, only on Android. I guess Korea is like Samsung, right? So no iPhone on that. And I think it's in Korean. So, you know, they're sending me the, the instructions to figure out how to use it. But look, here, check it out. It's got a motor there. All the functions, what it can do. And it moves pretty quick too. I've seen sample videos of it. It's not new, it's old, but it's very, very, very limited. So it's either I open one box and build it and then there's only one left. But we only have two pieces of these and they're available in the store. Just email us if you want to find out like how much it is. I have no idea how much it is. 
But I'm gonna put that aside. What else? Is there anything else left? Yeah, check this out. My mama got this for me. She went to Japan, Tokyo. Thank you, mom, for this. This is actually pretty cool. She got me the storage box. She said there wasn't much in Japan, so she was only able to find this. This is really cool. This is like a storage for your minifigures, right? Is it old? New? I don't know. I have a, there, there's a Japanese sticker right there. You can see it's in Japanese. Yeah. And it actually says here, Lego storage and lunch. Can you fit your lunch in there? I don't know, but let's open it anyway, since I want to do something a little special with you guys with this one. Oh. oh. We don't need no stinking box. Okay, cool. All right, there it is. Storage. 16 minifigures can fit inside here. Got a little door compartment here. And here. Yeah. Then you gotta show that in slow-mo. Chucker Nick sent me his own minifigure. This is him. So what I want to do is I'm going to use this display storage for all you guys. Like, you, if you're sending me minifigures, if you're going to send them to the office, I'm going to put you in this case. You're going to be a part of the video. And if it gets more than 16, I will keep growing on top of it. So for now, first one is Trucker Nick. We'll see how this grows. Maybe it'll stay like this forever. I don't know if anyone else will be in here. But if you're going to send me a minifigure, you're going to go in here. There you guys go. All right, so guys, so that's the unboxing for the week and store updates. And I'll be back next week for more. Let's see what comes in the store next week. I wonder what's gonna arrive. I can't wait, man. I can't wait to do more unboxings for you guys. I'll catch you guys later. So until then, break me out. Bah! They can be dizzy looking at it. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support for this channel. Please subscribe on Scott's face and watch some videos over here. And maybe some other ones you haven't seen over here. Keep it coming guys! I'm starting to actually like it here! I think I am!